Hey, Stephen Hyde. Uh, it is the first day of school, but we need to, have you <laughs> thought of the new metaphor yet for this year? I don't know. Maybe it's the like, maybe it's the season proving grounds or something. Okay. Yeah. Fair enough. Yeah. It's the reunion. <laughs> <laughs> the reunion. All right. It's the class reunion yeah. here uh, at Rochester. Yeah. Uh, how have you been? How did your uh, summer go? It was amazing. Um, you know, it was, it was kind of tough. Uh, post last cross season um, I just had a lot of work to do to like kind of get out of that hole um, that I well I dug by crashing a few times and so um, I needed to take a nice like early uh, breather kind of for uh, for the spring so I took a lot of time off took more than I expected um, had some really good rebuilding experiences and um, then I got to do some really cool racing. I got to go out to do Tour Bos. I got to do some local racing, which is always fun. Um, I got to do BC Bike Race, and uh, yeah, it was really fun. BC Bike Race looks like a bucket list race, is it? It's an absolute bucket race. It's <laughs> unbelievable. Um, yeah, I can't wait. I'm, I mean, I'm planning my return. <laughs> Katie and I did it as a, a, a co-ed team, mm -hmm. and uh, we both decided that we were going to go back for, um, uh, for the individual next year. Um, so yeah, we're working that out. Should be, I'm very excited. Yeah. When we talked at Nats, you said there were a lot of question marks uh, for you last season, and we saw that. To what extent did you, you know, do you build on that or, you know, take something from that? And to what extent do you put that in the past and look forward to this year? Oh, man. Uh, you know, I think it's one of those things where, like, I would love to be able to put some of that behind me, but, uh, you know, the stone that the builder refused, you know, like, it's, it's become a... a a lot of those kind of downfalls have become like a real cornerstone for me and I realized that yeah like I got pretty messed up and like <laughs> I had some pretty hard times but also that like I came back from them and I, I did what I wanted to do and I proved that like I proved to myself that I could do that and that I really really wanted to uh, I don't know when I want to do something and I set my mind to it that I can do it and you know have the power to do that so uh, I build on that, you know, I, I'm thankful for the opportunity to be able to do that, you know, yeah, it was sucky, but <laughs> I made something out of it, and uh, it absolutely destroyed me, but, you know, I did it, I, yeah. I did what I wanted to do out of it, so. Looking forward yeah. to this weekend, we saw a couple of your, a couple of your boys throwing down at Rochester, yeah. you know, but there's going to be so many more yeah. of those names and, yeah. you know, people who are ready. Um, totally. What are you, what are you expecting from this weekend? Well, I think it's going to be interesting. We're going to have, um, you know, we just talked about it kind of being a reunion for like the North American crowd, but also we have some, some riders here from, from Europe now. We have Lucas Winterberg, who's done a couple of seasons here, is always, you know, kind of a perennial. He always comes back good somehow. Um, uh, Vincent Bastien's like all, all these guys that are going to come, you know, over from Switzerland and from Belgium. Uh, it'll be interesting. Uh, Denmark. Um, it's gonna. It's it's cool because like, you know, I looked at last weekend and I in the past have not done that weekend and mm -hmm. have still have not done that weekend um, at Go Cross. And it's always a little bit nerve wracking for me because I look at that and I see what's going on and I'm like, oh god, this guy's are racing! Like, ah, ah, you know, your mind explodes a little bit. But uh, it's also, it's a good time for reflection for me and to just like look at. I, I take that weekend for myself and I say like, okay, am I ready? Have I done everything I wanted to do? Uh, you know, and you know, this is when I said I was going to be good and um, you know, am I there? And so, uh, it's it's really cool to see those guys race down there and to see that crowd going on and um, to see another race on the calendar, that's really good, especially when races are going away. Uh, but for me, this is always my focus and um, uh, I'm ready to mix it up with anyone who shows up. So I'm, I'm, I'm ready, yeah, I'm excited. Uh, one last question. Yep. Don't want to go into specifics too much, but hate yep. to give away uh, your secrets. But That's last year, <laughs> I mean, I think last year you guys really set the tone and you said at Rochester, we're going all in. There's none yep. of this sitting around. You know, sure. Do you anticipate that for yeah. this year? Is there that same sense of urgency? Well, I think it's going to be different because we have different players. Right. Um, I, I think the, that the, you know, whoever those top riders may be normally uh, now have some extra players in the field and so I, I don't think we get to dictate that anymore and I'm personally excited about that I think that you know flavor is good like added a little extra spice to it it's fantastic um, I love racing like that I, I don't like racing the same course of the same people over and over and over and over you know uh, so this is good I think it's gonna be great I'm anticipating some battles I'm anticipating it to be difficult and very hard 
and you know, I might win, I might lose. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Very poetic. You yeah. might win, you might lose. That's why they race the races, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm excited no matter who shows up. You know, it's like this could be a World Cup for all I care. Um, I'm still going to put the same amount of effort into it and the same planning goes into it. So I can't be any better than I am That's right now. You know. <laughs> well, cool, man. Well, it is it's good to be reunited yeah. with you again and same. look forward to seeing you yeah. out on the course repping for uh, cool. Team USA. Yeah, thank you. Uh, thanks, dude. Yeah.